Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install TensorFlow in your Visual Studio Code editor so that you can run your TensorFlow Python script on your Visual Studio Code editor. So as you can see, I have uh, this folder opened in my Visual Studio Code editor, which doesn't contain any uh, files yet. So let's create a Python file. I'm going to name my file as test.py here and then press enter which creates this file and if you haven't installed the python extension just install it so you just click on uh, this extensions tab and then search for python and whatever result you see on the top just click on that and then if you see install button here just install that that will help you to develop python script on visual studio code in a better way once you have uh, this python script just uh, add a tensorflow uh, code here this is just a hello world tensorflow code so it's not very uh, special we just want to see how we can run this script right now let's open our terminal so i'm going to just open the terminal here and here you can see which kind of terminal is open right now powershell is open i want to use the command prompt so i can just click on this uh, drop down menu and select command prompt here and then let's try to run this uh, program first so to run a python script you just write python and the name of your script which is test.py in our case and it will show this kind of error which says uh, import uh, tensorflow as tf module not recognized when you hover over this tensorflow uh, import you will see import could not be resolved by lace right so now let's see how we can install tensorflow so that we can run this script now there are two ways in which you can install tensorflow one is by directly running the pip install tensorflow command the other and the more correct way will be to install tensorflow using the virtual environment and the virtual environment will help you to install tensorflow just in your project so that if you want to uh, use a different TensorFlow version in different TensorFlow project, you can do that, right? So TensorFlow will be installed just in your project and that's the proper way of doing this. So for that, you need to create a virtual environment on your Visual Studio Code. For doing this, you just write Python, then space hyphen M, and then write V E N V for virtual env and then just provide the name of your virtual environment you can give any name to your virtual environment i'm going to give the name my env here right and then i'm going to press enter which is going to create this virtual env in my project folder as you can see here this directory is created with the name my env because i have named my virtual env as my env here and then you will also see this kind of notification which says we noticed a new environment has been created do you want to select this uh, for your workspace folder just click on yes here what this will do is it's going to select this virtual env environment uh, for your project right and you will see that here so when you click on this uh, 3.11 or whatever python version you have you will see the name of your virtual environment here and you can also select a global python uh, from here but we have created virtual environment so we will select this one right once virtual environment is created you need to activate it before using it so to activate it you need to run the script which is inside this virtual end folder which is under the script folder and the script name is activate so to activate the script let me just uh, maximize the font size here so that you can see this uh, command in a better way to activate this script just write the name of your virtual env folder which is my env in my case and then just write backslash and then just write uh, scripts which is the name of this folder and then once again backslash and then just write activate okay so we want to call this script then press enter and once you do that it's going to execute the script and the way you recognize that your 
virtual env is activated is that your folder name for virtual env will be listed here before you will not see this uh, listed here before this uh, uh, command palette right now once your virtual env is created let's uh, install uh, tensorflow library using pip so just write pip install tensorflow here and then press enter which is going to install the tensorflow package on your project so once tensorflow is installed you will see this kind of message which says successfully installed these packages so tensorflow comes with all these other packages which comes as their dependencies right so once uh, tensorflow is installed we are ready to run our tensorflow script this time once again just type python and the name of the script which is test.py in our case and then press enter so now you can see it's going to show you the output for your tensorflow script so this is how you can install tensorflow for python on your visual studio code editor i hope you've enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next video